Greetings. I am coming to you from a very dark room to talk about a forbidden subject. That is cleaning coins. Is there ever a time where it's acceptable to clean a coin? I ask this because I just cleaned a coin and I think it was an acceptable thing to do. I want to start by saying I am not a monster. For example, during our kitchen remodel, under a baseboard in our old stone house, I found a key date Indian head penny, 1872. It's in pretty great shape. Now, I know better than to clean that. I touched it by the edges. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I, I, I ran a little bit of our reverse osmosis water over it to get the dust off and then let it air dry. Didn't touch the faces of it. I'm not a monster. Same thing with this half scent that we found in the house during our adventures. Now, it is pretty widely known in the coin community that cleaning coins is not acceptable 99.9% .9 of the time. And I'm not here to tell you that that's wrong. That's correct. Because normally cleaning a coin is devastating for the value of the coin. So uh, I do believe there are certain circumstances where the opposite is true. And let me give you an example. Every year as part of my boys' Christmas gift, I give them silver, whether it's a silver eagle or a constitutional silver. I, I want to teach them about what sound money is and, and kind of get the ball rolling in the right direction for them. This year, since they've been into like treasure and fossils and buried things, I picked up this lot of three shipwrecked silver eight real coins that have spent most of their life underwater. I'm not sure what shipwreck they came from, but there's obvious salt water damage. And two of them were about the same where you could see the details of the pillars and the crown in the back. And uh, I mean, they, they were worn pretty good, but you know, if you have more than one child that you can't give them both presents and have one of them be a lot better than the other. So it was obvious from the get go that those two were going to be in their present. And I was going to kind of keep the dog <laughs> from my collection. Uh, this other one, I mean, you could barely tell what it was. It had a little bit more meat to it, but for some reason it was it was rougher. And I thought, you know, what the heck? This thing's been under the sea for most of its life. It's had sand scrubbing it, and there's it's not in pristine shape. So it can't get any worse. What do I have to lose with this cruddy looking one? What could it hurt if I tried to see if we could get some more detail out of it? So I soaked it in CLR. Uh, CLR is uh, wonderful if you're trying to remove like mineral deposits from your uh, water fixtures. We get like calcium buildup on fixtures and like I have to spray the little shower plunger to turn on the shower or else it kind of gets sticky. So I have some experience with CLR and I was thinking like if this is like coral or some kind of minerals or I, salt and sand that that are stuck in the details of this coin, maybe CLR would help. So I soaked it in CLR. I even took a toothbrush to it a little bit. I mean, like, this is blasphemous in the coin world. You, you don't do this. Um, but look at the difference here. I mean, we went from just an absolute turd to what I think is the bell of the ball. Compared to the other two, now this is the nice one, I think. And I would be really curious to see how, like, one of the coin grading companies would label this. If they would label it clean. Because, I mean, like, any of these coins that are under the water, they're usually very shiny from getting rubbed around in the sand. Almost like they've been through one of those rock tumblers. Uh, so... I would be curious to see if they would designate it as cleaned or if they would just put salt water damage. In my opinion, I don't think I caused 
damage to it. I think I made it better, not worse. So any of my coin friends, I would be curious to hear what you have to say about what I did. Do I have like a, a red C on my forehead now that I cleaned a coin? How bad was this? Or is this good? I see in this case, I think it was good. I want to hear in the comments what you think. And let me know if you want to be my coin friend. If you don't have any coin friends, you need to get some because they're awesome. Just comment below, push the like button, maybe even share this video. Tell me if you've cleaned a coin and how you justify it, you know? Uh, so anyway, peace out.